Vanishing Coeds, Bloodless Bodies, Mysterious Intruders. That's right, people. I'm talking Night Trap! Oh, buddy! <laughs> Night Trap! Finally, 27 years later, I get Night Trap on a Nintendo system. I am so pumped about this game. Once upon a time, it was said to never have be on a Nintendo system, and yet here we are, 2019, and I get to play this gem of a game. And actually, this game, believe it or not, holds a very special place in video game history. Not because, as they state, it is the first game card title with continuous full motion video and audio. No, because this is responsible for the rating system. That's right, video game rating system you know t for teen m for mature e for everyone you know that is because of night trap and mortal Kombat. apparently in the 90s video games were going to ruin the nation's youth and they singled out Mortal Kombat and this game. Now this game's a little weird because even if you completely disagree with the assessment that video games are going to cause just a whole wave of violent action from teenagers, which I actually do disagree with, you can at least understand why they would think Mortal Kombat is too violent of a game to be played by say eight year olds or 10 year olds and maybe a rating system was warranted because of a game like Mortal Kombat. But however, this one, <laughs> Night Trap, this is a B movie. Seriously, the acting is so bad. The plot is so paper thin. It is ridiculous. It's like Sharknado without the Sharknado, but the acting and all that stuff is just there. The cheese factor on this. If I put this between two pieces of bread, I would have a like a grilled cheese sandwich. It is so bad that it circles all the way around and becomes good. Let me read it to you. The next generation of video game consoles, Night Trap is the first card title with continuous full motion video and audio. It plays like a movie with hours of awesome gameplay. Get one game card pack with sinister scenes and live action video. Vanishing co-eds, bloodless bodies, mysterious intruders as a secret commando for SCAT. S C A T. Special control attack team. Your missions a time bomb. Five beautiful co-eds are being stalked in an eerie estate. Hooded intruders are invading the mansion with blood on their minds. Watch the mysterious action from hidden cameras in eight different rooms. Catch the intruders as they track their victims. Miss your chance and the coeds are lost for ever. You gotta play to believe it. And I definitely agree with that last statement. You gotta play to believe it. Or watch me live stream it because I'm pretty confident I am going to stream this game. My channel is a PG channel, but because we're saying T for teen, I will stream this eventually. Not today. Today, we're just going to unbox this beauty. It came from Limited Run Games. My wife looked at the cover and gave me a questionable glance. And I'm like, don't worry. It's just the cover. It's kind of like Pulp Fiction-esque artwork of the 30s and stuff. It's really not, not bad. They're basically in PJs. I remember this game. It's one of a handful of Sega games that I actually played growing up. I didn't play with it because I knew of the controversy. No, I didn't hear about the controversy until many years later. Basically, I had a friend loan me his Sega Genesis with the Sega CD. I blew past all of the crappy acting scenes because I really like tower defense games or games where you set booby traps and this game had it. So I'm one of the few people who actually probably enjoyed the actual gameplay of <laughs> this game. But I'm telling you what, I remember how bad it was and I cannot wait to get back in. So I bought this game and I thought I would get myself a regular copy and maybe one copy to trade but then when they sent me the standard copies there's two different covers i did not know there was going to be two different covers so now i'm not going to trade anything but i'm going to open the collector's edition right now but check out this these covers here and there's also a different description so i'll read the different description and i'll put these aside what if you could control your favorite movie if you were a part of the action, if you made the difference between life and death, Night Trap, the groundbreaking CD-ROM that started the interactive video revolution is back. Night Trap makes you the most important character in a real movie with real actors, not computer-generated cartoon characters. <laughs> 
Like, ugh, gross cartoon characters. Forget the laggy response, small window, and jerky video you come to expect from other CD-ROMs. The tech on display here will make your Nintendo Switch scream. So obviously, you know, they did their own little new one for the standard copy. But I believe this right here, the explanation on the collector's edition, I think that's more OG original. Before we go any further, shout out to Limited Run Games because originally... This came like so, but it was all damaged right here. If you can't see it, it came to me all creased up. So I was really disappointed because like I said, I want this game for my collection. So I actually went on to Limited Run Games website. I filed a problem and I told them what happened and they actually sent me a brand new slip cover for the collector's edition. So now let's get into it and see what this has to offer. I am not using my master sword that I use for mail call Mondays because that thing is very dull. I'm gonna need an actual sharp knife for this. There is a saran wrap plastic, so I wanna just get that off very carefully without ruining anything. Okay, so this is what it looks like. First thing to come out is another case for Night Trap. I'm not sure exactly which case this is. Night Trap was released on the Sega CD, the Sega 32X, whatever that was. I'm not too well versed in Sega Genesis, so I could be wrong. I believe this is the Sega 32X case right there. There is the, I guess these are the actual vampires. And then we've got, oh, there's the dude. Here's your uh, leader F scat. And you have a bunch of stuff and it says limited run over one and a half hours of full motion video night trap 100 full motion interactive video this says what if you could control your favorite movie what if you were a part of the action if you made the difference between life and death night trap is the groundbreaking oh okay so it, it reads the same as the standard edition but then it adds bullet points a real interactive movie not a computer generated game Control hidden rooms in eight different rooms. Control a series of traps to capture anyone that threatens innocent lives. Five teenagers have disappeared from a bizarre lakeside house. You are enlisted as a special agent responsible for protecting the lives of another group of teenagers visiting the house. Don't even think of messing up. People's lives are in your hands. It's like, okay, why aren't these scat guys just saying, hey, teenagers, kids, don't go in the house, and they just raid the house. Like, <laughs> why don't they just raid the house, people? And look at that. They used to have this kind of styrofoam or something when it came to Sega games. And so they have this styrofoam and a little spot for your itty bitty little Switch game. Oh, look, and now they also have the CD. Maybe I should actually acquire a CD to put in here of Night Trap. The attention to detail is such a beautiful thing that limited run games do. They are such a nerd company. It's crazy. Now let's see what this is because not only did these act as a cover, but they acted as the manual. So let's see if this is the manual. Got to be careful though because it's black and this, this black glossy paper, your fingerprints will leave a mark for confidential eyes only, codename Night Trap. Mission number 230, Commander Sims. Oh, here we go. We got the whole story. This is the story. Mission background. Five teenagers have disappeared in the vicinity of Lake Shore Winery House of Mr. and Mrs. Victor Martin. This is so bad. Scat, undercover intelligence, has determined that the teenagers were reported missing after spending the night as invited guest at the Martin's house. The Martin claims the missing teenagers left the Martin's house Sunday night. Police investigations failed to turn up the evidence of their whereabouts. The case was turned over to Scat. So I guess there's this married couple just inviting kids over and then when five of them go missing, nobody really cares and sends five more kids to this house. Security system. In a previous undercover operation, Scat Missions 229, a Scat agent infiltrated the Martin's house and discovered something unusual. Hidden surveillance cameras had been installed in eight locations across the house. Guest bedroom, bedroom, upstairs hallway, hall two, entryway, back hallway, hall one, 
Living room, kitchen, driveway. More curious is the series of traps located throughout these locations. Scat Intelligence believes the cameras and traps may be part of an elaborate security system. Hmm, you think? You think? Continued. As part... <laughs> this is so dumb. As part of the covert infiltration, our scat agent spliced an override cable into the trap and camera control system. The override cable located in the back hallway allows scat to remotely control the cameras and traps. If anyone inside the house discovers the override cable, the covert status of the operation may be jeopardized. The trap controls are protected with an access code in one of six color variations. Red, green, blue, yellow, orange, or purple. The correct access color code must be entered in order for the traps to work. Beware that anyone in the house can change the code at any time from the Martin's hidden control unit. Uh-oh, the situation. Five more teenagers are on their way to the Lakeshore Winery House at the invitation of the Martins. Hey girls, I know five kids just disappeared here, but hey, why don't you come on over anyways and have, you know, a sleepover? Unknown to anyone else, one of them is Scat's team best undercover, Kelly Med. <laughs> and then she has a gun. Like, oh, Kelly Med. Kelly Med's on the case, people. Don't worry. Your mission, control of the hidden cameras and traps, has been routed to your Nintendo Switch remote unit. Use it to protect Kelly and the other teenagers from any danger inside the house. Switch cameras from room to room to follow the teenagers and to look for any danger. Use the traps as necessary to capture anyone or anything that may endanger the teenagers. Make sure you don't capture any of the teenagers or members of your SCAT team. Together with Kelly, you must find out what has happened to those missing teenagers and whatever else is going on in that house. Listen to conversations to pick up clues and to find out when the access code is changing. Don't fail this mission. <laughs> For confidential scat night trap. Eyes only. And then the bulletin board. For those who own personal computing devices equipped with a modem and telecommunication software, technical support and customer service can be brought into your house at 300, 1200, 2400 BAUD boards from the limited run online BBS. Callers should set their telecommunication package to reflect eight data bits, one stop bit and no parity. I have no idea what that means. I have no idea what that means. So we got ourselves a manual now with our uh, Sega CD case or whatever it is. Then something else here. This looks like a Night Trap poster. There we go. Should I frame this guy? Should it go right up next to my Link Between Worlds poster? <laughs> look at these guys. Oh, look. I want to be on that team. Look at this baby right here. This. This is huge. This is a VHS. Did you know that there was something before DVDs? Yeah, VHS. And it's even in one of those really thick VHS cases, Night Trap. For the first time ever, the cult classic game Night Trap is available as a 48-minute motion picture on video cassette. Experience the terror like never before. You better be good. You better beware. Night Trap! Wow, on a VHS. I wonder how much it cost them to do a VHS. Did you guys know that my parents actually owned family-owned video rental store and it was before DVDs? I remember having to go up there while my parents basically worked and I would just sit in the back watching movies and Dumbo scared the crap out of me. You know when Dumbo got drunk? That thing, it just scared the crap out of me. So VHS, they hold a very special place in my heart because... I had to rewind so many of those stupid tapes. But yeah, VHS, a VHS, a modern day VHS. Let's, should I open it? Yeah, let's just open it. Let's just see the whole thing. Oh, Night Trap, look at it, look at it. So here's the case, just normal. Man, this is, this is a trip. You know what? I totally forgot that my parents owned a video store. I totally forgot. I, I did not remember that. I must have blocked that out, but it's all coming back to me. It's all coming back to me because of Night Trap. And there's two more things in here. We have the game, Night Trap, and it looks like, is that different? Looks like it's the same exact from the standard copy. And then we have one more thing in here. And what is this? Okay, so, oh, you know what? 
a steel book. This is coming with a steel book. This is actually a really nice steel book. Yeah, not trap. And then you have your again. Looks like the that artwork is probably the Pulp Fiction artwork is probably the standard artwork that you're gonna get in modern day Night Trap. And let's see, let's open it up. And you have the two vampire faces, a dude and a chick, I believe. And it's just a really cool steel book. This is like a plastic, but nice plastic i don't really know how to <laughs> describe that just a really nice plastic and let's look inside night trap the game itself real quick before this channel believe it or not i would not open anything but now that i have this channel i feel like i owe it to you guys to open this stuff so we can just record and document this video game legacy that's out there. My camera died while filming, so sorry about that. Things might be a little different. Anyways, I was just about to open this up to see what we have inside. Night Trap again, I've already read the back, and... Ooh, there's something inside, something inside. Looks like we have a Night Trap. You know what? It is the manual that I read earlier. And it looks to be the exact same except for miniaturized. So it comes with a manual. If you look inside, you can see that here is the cover, but you can reverse the cover as well. So it doesn't look like these are two separate editions. It just looked like they have the covers on in different cellophane wrappings. So there you go. And I will double check that because it looks like everything is exactly the same. And if I feel like it, I can just switch out the cover. Yep, that's pretty much it. And just switch out the cover. Don't feel you need to get both of these editions now because it's literally just the reverse of whatever is on the outside. Here is the actual game. And so there you have it, a game that was never going to be on a Nintendo product finally here on a Nintendo product. Would you guys mind if I live stream Night Trap? Would you, would you laugh it up with me on some random Tuesday or Wednesday? I don't know when, but just let me know if you want me to. I don't know, does it, does it not fit my channel? Because I think, I think it'll be hilariously bad. I think we'll have a good time. Let me know in the comments below if you would like me to live stream this bad boy right here. Also, please give me a thumbs up, a thumbs down, hit that bell for notifications and it's dangerous to go alone please share this video this channel with a friend and hey if you have any other bad games out there you know so bad it's good please comment below because i am a glutton for punishment when it comes to those type of games guys have a great day